With overwhelming bipartisan support, the United States House has advanced the renewal of a critical national security surveillance law. It's a program the FBI director has called indispensable, saying it's vital to protecting Americans, especially in the fight against terrorism. ABC's M. Nguyen has more from Washington. After a chaotic week of infighting, House Speaker Mike Johnson pushed through the renewal of a powerful national security surveillance program. The yeas are 273, the nays are 147. The FBI calling the Foreign Intelligence Surveillance Act, or FISA, critical to the security of all Americans, especially in the fight against terrorism. Our most immediate concern has been that individuals or small groups will draw some kind of twisted inspiration from the events in the Middle East to carry out attacks here at home. The FISA law allows U.S. intelligence agencies to collect the communications of foreign nationals without a warrant. It sometimes collects data on Americans who interact with persons of interest. If they don't fall in the exceptions and they're searching Americans, searching your name, your phone number, your email address in this giant, this giant database, that should scare us. The revised version shortens the law's lifespan from five years to two years. The House also narrowly voting down an amendment which would have prohibited warrantless searches of U.S. person communications with exceptions for imminent threats to life or bodily harm. The failed amendment was introduced by a group of bipartisan lawmakers, including Representative Pramila Jayapal. We should not be expanding FISA. We should be creating safeguards to protect foundational civil liberties rights. Meanwhile, Speaker Mike Johnson is meeting today with former President Trump in Florida to discuss election integrity. I don't ever comment on my private conversations with President Trump, but I'm looking forward to going to Florida and spending some time. The House still needs to vote on whether to reconsider the legislation before it can head to the Senate. The deadline to reauthorize the FISA law before it lapses is next Friday. M1, ABC News, Washington.